Get the trigonometric function alone first. So we got three tangent squared x equals uno. Then we got to divide by three. And so I get tangent squared x equals one thread. One thread? One thread. And then how do I get that squared to be gone? Square root the foo. All right, so now I get tangent um, x. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Plus or minus. Square root of 1 over square root of 3. Square root of 1 is just 1. We got a plus or minus? What? Diggity what? Okay, so tangent x equals plus or minus. Uh, that would be 1 over the square root of 3. Or you can write this as plus or minus the square root of 3 over 3. And if you guys have that mini chart, the mini chart will help you. Because uh, this is weird. You have to think about what y divided by x would give me. Uh, a positive and a negative, or a negative, right? Three over three. You guys remember those? It is. It is. Um, I don't know if you guys remember this chart. I'm just going to throw this chart up here really fast. Pi over six, pi over four, pi over three. You guys remember this? Okay, and then if you do uh, just the pi over sixes, you'll see it. It would be, it would be um, uh, one half, and then red three over two, and then if you divide those, you go one half times the reciprocal of the cosine, you get one over red three. Hey yo! So, any angle that has a pi over six as its reference angle will give you um, either positive red three over three or negative red three over three. Let's see, let's check out our unit circle now. Um, we know this one would work. This is a uh, pi over six. What is this angle? Pi o five pi over six. And what's this angle? Seven pi over six. These all have a reference angle of pi over six. What's this one? Eleven pi over six. Oh snap! So we got we gotta somehow come up with all those. Is there a pattern? Is there something I can add to get to each of these? Is there? Is there one number I can add to get all those? No. 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 Yeah, so we have to add the, the first one, pi over 6, and we're going to add to that the period. Well, there's a pattern. This would be, a, this would be a all positive rad, or rad 3 over 3s. And then the other one would be 5 pi over 6 plus pi n. Now, how come it's pi and not 2 pi like the last one? Yeah, because the period of tangent is just pi. Or you can look at the unit circle and go, well, I'd have to go pi, pi radians to get all the way to that one. And plus pi, plus pi, or just keep me on this one the whole time. So then we have to do a separate one for 5 pi over 6.